Yeah. What was that? I don't know. I have no idea, bro. I just felt like starting a video like that. So what? <laughs> What's good, TMG fam? It's your boy Ellen back with another reaction. Now, if you were like me, and maybe you were, you know, maybe you had free reign to do what you wanted to do, and if you did, then you were one of the lucky ones. But as for me, my family didn't like my no, no not to just say my family. My mom didn't like The Simpsons. She didn't like me watching it, even though I still watched it. She didn't like me watch. She didn't like The Simpsons. She just had some serious vendetta against The Simpsons. You know what I'm saying? Which was, I, I get her points. It was warranted. Simpsons do, do toe the line. They do take it far. They do have fun with it. You know what I'm saying? But what if she just saw uh, some of the new shows? <laughs> She would have been uh, uh, just, just, but, but anyway, either way, um, the Simpsons, man, this is, <laughs> this is the Simpsons joke that I didn't get as a kid. So this is very nostalgic for me, man. Uh, um, I, is this still like the longest running show? I think it is. I think it is. I hate to watch it now because they're so good at predicting the future that I don't want to know. I, I, I don't want to know at all. I just, I, I, I avoid the Simpsons because every time I see one of those videos where they accurately predict something, it's usually correct. So yeah, I stay away, but we're going to get back and go back and see some of the jokes we might have missed that kind of flew over our head. All right. If you're new to the channel, man, hit the subscribe button. Let's go. Bard, where'd you get that shirt? Uh oh, came out of the closet. Uh, Huh. <laughs> I definitely didn't get that back then, but you didn't hear a lot of uh like gay talk back then. It wasn't a thing back then, really. If you heard the talk back then, it was more so associated to like what was it? Was it back then? Maybe it was it was people saying that it was related to like HIV or something. If you were that, then you had. It was something like that. And I don't want to be insensitive or nothing about anything, but I'm just remembering the times back when. So you didn't hear much about that. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Came out of the closet. Uh, huh. If you were a kid and you got that joke, you were way advanced and you listened to all your parents' conversations. Well, well. Dude, it's time for you to go to bed. But Mom, I want to hear the witty banter of sophisticated adults. Yeah, you can't have any fun in bed. <laughs> oh, son, when you're older, you'll know better. <laughs> mm. Oh, baby. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I like how they how they took the sandwich and placed the sandwich there, but they they know good and well that's not what they was talking about, bro. But but nice way to kind of curve it for TV. <laughs> Oh, baby. Mm. Yeah. Hey, way to go, Hummer! Way to go! Hey, wouldn't like to tell the boss. Tell him I'm going to the back seat of my car with a woman I love, and I won't be back for ten minutes! And the Emmy goes to... Oh, I don't believe this. Sideshow Bob! <laughs> I still remember the episodes or when they would do the little cutaway scene to him stepping on that what, what was it a rake or something he was stepping on and he hit it <laughs> they do that man <laughs> throw back Sideshow Bob this is one more Emmy than you'll ever win you bantering jack in the box just don't drop that thing in the shower Bob <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I definitely didn't catch that one as a kid. Yo. <laughs> oh, lousy smart weather. <laughs> Do not touch Willie. Good advice. <laughs> Yo. Yo, these dudes. These dudes was wild. I feel like now I need to go back and watch all the seasons of The Simpsons over, bro. Don't touch Willie. <laughs> Do not touch Willie. Good advice. Come on, Homer. I'm insisting on a fisting. What's this about a fisting? Wow. Now I see why they call you Miss Hoover. 
He must have been vacuuming for an hour. Anything to please my man. And they never ruin their fun by giving in to their throbbing biological er Listen to what he's saying for those. I know a lot of us got that off the bat, but there's some people still sitting there like, huh? Listen to what he says. Homer, I'm insisting on a fisting. What's this about a fisting? Not that, this. Well, now I see why they call you Miss Hoover. <laughs> now I see why they call you Miss Hoover? Wow. You must have been vacuuming for an hour. Son, an hour? Anything to please my man. And they never ruin their fun by giving in to their Ooh. throbbing biological urges. Then came the big day. Fluffy and Fuzzy got married. That night came the honeymoon. She's baking it. Oh, there's Krusty the Clown. <laughs> Krusty, Krusty, say something funny. Oh, dear joke ever. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, funny. Uh, okay, this guy walks into a bar and takes out a tiny piano and a 12 inch pianist. Oh, no, wait. I can't tell that one. Oh. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these dudes, the writers was pervs, man. That's what all this boils down to. I should go. I don't even like him. You're right, Lise. You shouldn't go. It wouldn't be honest. I'll go, disguised as you. What if he wants to hold hands? We're prepared to make that sacrifice. What if he wants a kiss? We're prepared to make that sacrifice. What if he... You don't want to know how far I'll go. I... <sighs> now I see why my mom didn't want me watching this, bro. She might have caught all the subliminals, man. What's a kiss? We're prepared to make that sacrifice. What if he... You don't want to know how far I'll go. I enrolled at Springfield Heights in... And I used to think Bart was like the coolest out of all of them. How many of y'all as a kid used to just sit in class and just draw Bart Simpson? I was that guy. Sit there and just sketch him out, draw him. He was easy to draw if you first starting to draw out the crazy little pointy triangle little things in his hair. You draw that out in the head and the, the face and all that kind of stuff like that, man. I used to think Bart was the coolest, but now after hearing that. That sacrifice. What if he, you don't want to know how far I'll go. I enrolled at Springfield Heights Institute of Technology. Well, Mark, should I wax slow or fast? Slow, then fast. <laughs> Marge was a freak. Oh. Super freak, super freak. Marge was super freaky. Let's see how she talk. Her voice always sound like, you know, she used to smoke heavily back in the day. Then fast. <laughs> <laughs> Is Marge Bouvier. I'm here about your aunt. Single white female wanted for mysterious expedition. Must like monkeys. Non-smoker preferred. Well, you'd be a welcome change of pace from the rest of these crude and uncouth sailors. Arr, 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 arr. What do you think, Smithies? I think women and semen don't mix. We know what you think. Yeah. <laughs> and that's crazy coming from Smithers because we knew how he felt about Mr. Burns. Ah! My whole childhood is being ruined right now. Ah! What do you think, Smithies? I think women and semen don't mix. We know what you think. Young lady, you're hired. <laughs> That is flagrant false advertising. You'll be fine. There's a pup for every possum. Give me another chance. I'll be way more attentive to your needs on the seesaw. Well, I'll stay down there for as long as you want. Homer? What is it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. 
Hey, try and get my man Bart Lockjaw. You more attentive to your needs on the seesaw. Well, I'll stay down there for as long as you want. Homer? What is it, Flanders? <laughs> I'm afraid I have a bone to pick with you. Look, if it's about your camcorder, I lost it, okay? <laughs> no. I, I, I came to talk to you about your potty mouth. What the hell are you talking about? Look, Homer, all of us pull a few boners now and then. Go off half cock, make asses of ourselves. I I definitely missed that episode. When have you ever heard Flanders talk like that? He was always the holier than thou type of guy. You know what I'm saying? But listen, man, let me know if this this take took you back. Now you, you might have been more advanced and brighter than me and caught a lot of this. But as for me, a person who I didn't I wouldn't say I was uh, a consistent watcher of The Simpsons, but I did catch a a, a, a decent amount. You know what I'm saying? And I never caught any of these jokes as a kid, bro. I didn't. I just didn't. It went over my head. Called me slow. It is what it is at this point. You know what I mean? But y'all let get at me in the comment section, man. Let me know what y'all think. Leave a like and, 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 and <laughs> it's, it's got me thrown off. I can't even close the video out, man. So I'm out. Till the next reaction of my piece. Y'all stay solid. Hey.